All right, babes. It's been a few months. You know what that means. We're heading to Trader Joe's. I regret to inform you that do you remember last time I went to Trader Joe's and I got those like mini croissants that you could bake, you know, that come in the popping thing? Those were in my fridge for a few months and then I took them out of the fridge like a week ago and they were expired. And my boyfriend always makes fun of me because it doesn't happen often, but you know, enough that it's kind of a pattern. I'll buy something and I'll be like, babe, no, 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 you can't eat it. I have to review it for YouTube. And then it'll just sit there because I don't have time to review it. And then by the time I have time, it'll go bad. And then he'll be like, I might as well, I might as well eat it. I, I could have eaten it this whole time. Which like, yes, now it's just wasted and it's all my fault. My, my sights are set on some bonbons. People told me to look for bonbons, but more importantly, apparently those like little mini cones now come in a vegan version and I want it so bad. Like that is my top priority. Uh, oh yeah, and, and, and Roberto said he wants uh, peanut butter cups, so I'm gonna look for that for him too, but that's not new, that's boring. But yeah, let's go. We have arrived. I have something else on my most wanted list and that is the green goddess dressing from last time too. Right off the bat, I found my green goddess dressing but I'm also trying this new one as well and I'm bringing lettuce. Look at these little baby zucchinis. Oh, I didn't know that you can buy zucchinis this size. I literally thought these were Persian cucumbers at first. This is random but I love seeing impossible meat price go down at Trader Joe's. Last time I checked, it was $7.99, and now it's $5.99. I'm not a fan of it, so I'm not gonna buy it. It'll go to waste, but vegan caramelized onion dip for people who like that, get on that. They also have something else that I wanted to show you. Ooh, vegan tzatziki dip. I'm not being dramatic when I say that I can smell these garlic naan crackers like through the box. And I think they're vegan. If I have space in my backpack, I'll come back for these. I wanted any of these cigarello flavors to be vegan and they all have whey in them. Oh my God, I really wanna try these. It is lentil and potato, but like curly and crispy. Yes. Vegan pork rinds? Okay, these are really hit or miss because I've had some pretty bad vegan pork rinds, but I'll try them. So I grabbed this just for groceries, you know, nothing interesting. I've had their vegetable fried rice, it's good in a pinch. And as y'all know, I've been in lots of pinches lately. But this is what I came for. This is precisely why I'm here. I'm definitely trying this today. We're in the candy aisle, and these dark chocolate covered cocoa beans are vegan, but I'm not gonna grab them. And I wanted this to be vegan so bad, but it's not. These fruit jellies are vegan and they're giving me like, you know those star sunkissed like jellies vibes? I'll put a photo here, but I'm like 99% sure this is just like a square version of those jellies. These turtle candies are vegan and we are getting them. And I think this is the chocolate like cups that Roberto wanted, so one for him. These dark chocolate covered pretzels, sadly, no. This is vegan but also disgusting. Do not buy it, just don't do it. So I never saw these, but soy creamery, they have vanilla ice cream and cherry chocolate chip, nice. Oh, this is oat ice cream, other non-dairy ice cream. The non-dairy section is a little beefier than usual. Love that. What? What is this? I, every time I come here, one thing just really knocks it out of the park for me in not a great way. And today, it is cold brew coffee barbecue sauce. Mm -mm, I'm not that bold. I wanna try like an instant super ramen or something. I'm more of a ramen person. Woo! Wow, the seasonings. Raspberry vinegar. What is that? These are the ones. These are the ones that went bad in the fridge. RIP to your fallen soldier. All right, so I grabbed some butter because we needed it. Um, and also, I'm gonna grab this almond butter cereal, partially because I wanna try it, but also partially because there's this like milk that I bought that I have to taste test, and I wanna put it in cereal. I have a very full basket, let's check out. I take it back, I found champagne grapes. Why am I gonna buy champagne grapes? Because Lizzo tried them on TikTok last week. I am a child. Got the goods, I filled this whole bag and my backpack. I don't think I've ever bought that much at Trader Joe's before. So I was on the way home, but then Roberto said he's on the bridge. 
I, I think he's he's coming here. Maybe I can give him his chocolate. I got you your your chocolate. <laughs> Okay, let's do a little grocery haul and I'll taste test as I pull things out of my bag. And as most of y'all know at this point, everything I don't taste test in this video will be taste tested in my all the new foods I try this month video. So let's get started. Starting with my backpack because that's where I put most of the refrigerated stuff. Except for this, Tangy Turtles. That's not refrigerated, but I will try it. What are these flavors? Does not even say, it does not even say the flavors, but we're gonna try one. They're so cute! They look like they have little life, life, life vests on their back. Look how cute that is! Very tropical. It tastes like pineapple and mango. Mmm! The more I eat it, the stronger the flavor it is, and the better it is. Mmm! You know, at first I was thinking like, like a 7 out of 10 situation, but this is easily an 8.5 out of 10 sort of situation. Yes, get this. We got... Frozen uh, vegetable fried rice, butter, butter, this is my go-to butter. We have dressings, uh, one that I already love so much, this is such a great dressing, but also spicy cashew butter that I'll be trying a different time. Ah, oh, but this is what I'm really excited for. We have to do this, okay. I wonder what the ice cream base is. Oh, coconut, mmm. Hmm, coconut is my least favorite ice cream substitute, but. Trader Joe's usually does good stuff, you know? You know, oh, they're individually wrapped. And they're so tiny, look how tiny, look how tiny. So cute. Okay, okay, okay. It is so incredibly tiny. Oh, it's like kind of a little bit. Ooh, it's, oh, the cone itself is broken, so I'm not gonna keep peeling it. We're just gonna try it as is but like look how cute i wonder if there's chocolate like in the bottom of the cone i mean this is basically just the bottom of the cone but whatever okay <laughs> yep 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 i mean i want to give it a 10. and there's chocolate in the bottom there's chocolate in the bottom too mm. Okay, nine and a half out of ten. Nine and a half out of ten, only because the top of the cone isn't very crunchy. But the bottom of the cone was crunchy. That was so, please run. Run and grab it. All right, next. Oh, I got these just for snacking for Roberto and I. I got this just for lettuce. Okay, we have to try these. Porkless snack rinds. Porkless snack rinds. So like right off the bat, I think the texture will be good. Okay, the texture is great. I don't know about the flavor. Oh, six and a half, seven. A little too tangy for my taste, I think. I also got these, but I'll try those another day. Almond butter cereal. Oh, I got canola spray just for like convenience. Ooh, ramen. We're not gonna try this right now, but I forgot I got ramen. I got salsa just for like Snacky nights. Oh, and I got champagne grapes, which I will be trying on TikTok just because Lizzo did it. I'm not usually that easily impressionable, but they're so tiny and cute. I had to try them. That was everything. Oh, no, 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 that wasn't everything. I got some bars because I'm living in between my apartment and my parents' house right now, and sometimes I get hungry and I have zero food on me. So I got two Cliff Builder bars for when I'm more hungry, and I got two uh, Cliff uh, regular bars from when I'm slightly less hungry because these tend to be like a little more beefy than these um, And that's everything I got. I paid about $42, which is like all right Yeah, it's all right for snacky items. Not so bad. But yeah, I hope you enjoyed that haul. I think today's trip was Incredibly successful incredibly successful. That's all I have for today Like if you like subscribe if you want to subscribe if you want to follow me on Instagram where I post every single day I'll put my Instagram right here and if you want to check out my patreon my patrons get all my videos uh, At least a couple days early and they get access to my finsta where I post a lot of weird random shit for no reason um, And that's all I have for today. I will talk to you next time. Goodbye Shout out to all my patrons, but especially my bodega bosses and my OG bodega babes. Jessica, Christina, Marlene, Lucia, Alex Creates, Ellen, Michelle, Laura, Kaylin, Marielle, Alex of Planet Earth, Jenny, Gemini, Janine, Curtis, Stacy, Michelle, Eduardo, Chloe, Erica, Sunny, Dana, Vanessa, Nakia, Matt, Jasmine, Mariana, Elty, Andrew, McKenna, and Shanta. You guys are the absolute best, and these videos are made possible with your support. 
If you want to support me non-monetarily, then just subscribe and stick around to watch another video. It shows YouTube that you like my content.